Hey guys, welcome to Tech Talks by Gaurav Sharma. Today, we're going to talk about the story of Aladdin and the lamp. Aladdin was just a poor guy who would do all this hard work to just get by and make his living until he found a lamp one day. And when he rubbed the lamp, a genie came, as you all know, right? And so genie would do anything that Aladdin would say, and that made Aladdin's life a lot more easier. He was able to work more. He was able to earn more and everything that goes with it, right? Pretty good, right? He was living a good life. Now, that Aladdin story, let's just bring that to our network organizations. Imagine all the users in your environment are Aladdin's and they found this lamp and when they rubbed it a genie came out and that genie is AI now your Aladdin's in your network are able to tell the genie to be doing uh, summarize some of their stuff or look up a lot of things and just to make their job easier nothing wrong with that everybody's moving to AI and so that's just the way to go but for the CISOs and security administrators the biggest concern is making sure that the users or the Aladdin's when they are asking their genies to do something they're not exposing some of the data uh, that they shouldn't be in the process knowingly or unknowingly right and then there are a lot of AI models or assets that are that companies are developing uh, of their own and we want to make sure that we're able to detect as a security administrator we're able to detect all these assets make sure that their models are not tampered with or if the, and, and just provide protection across the AI lifecycle Right, so two big use cases, ensuring the protection of the AI assets in the environment and avoiding the shadow AI, meaning there, there could be so many third, uh, third party AI gener uh, generative apps that the users or uh, Aladdin's could be using, right? But we only want to approve our approved genies to be able to access our environment and stuff, right? So if there's any third party one, we want to know about that and we want to block that. So Cisco AI Defense is that control that kind of monitors the activity of all the genies in your network to make sure that there's no unauthorized or shadow AI hap stuff happening. And if it's happening, it detects and controls that in real time. And also it detects the AI assets in your environment to protect them being tampered with or if there's anything uh, going on wrong with them, you, you, you get notified about that. So just protecting the overall AI lifecycle is also what Cisco AI Defense provides. So in order to know more about this, to control the genies in your environment, please reach out to your accounts team and they'll hook you up. Thank you.